Good morning, praise the Lord. Today, 4th October, we'll talk about uh, Luke, the person who wrote the Gospel of Luke and uh, Acts. Early tradition sources unanimously ascribe to Luke the authorship of the third Gospel and Acts, its sequel, although he is never mentioned by name in either of the books. We are indebted to Luke for his graphic account of the life of the perfect man and his thrilling narrative of the birth of the church. He was probably a Gentile from Antioch. Luke was a doctor by profession and he was a person of compassion as every ideal doctor should be. Although we know very few facts about his life, Luke has left us a strong impression of himself by what he wrote. In his gospel, he emphasizes Jesus Christ's compassion. He vividly recorded both the power demonstrated by Christ's life and the care with which Christ treated people. Luke highlighted the relationships Jesus had with women. His writing in Acts is full of sharp verbal pictures of real people caught up in the greatest events of history. Luke had a traveling um, medical practice as Paul's companion. Since the gospel was often welcomed with whips and stones those days, the doctor was undoubtedly seldom without patience. It is even possible that Paul's thorn in the flesh, as he uh, spoke in uh, Corinthians, was some kind of physical ailment that needed Luke's regular attention. Paul deeply appreciated Luke's skills and faithfulness. Paul makes a mention of uh, Luke in Colossians 4.14, Philemon 24, and 2 Timothy 4.11. God also made special use of Luke as a historian of the early church. Repeatedly, the details of Luke's descriptions have been proven accurate. The first words in the gospel indicate his interest in the truth. Luke's compassion reflected his lords. Luke's skill as a doctor helped Paul. His passion for the facts as he recorded the life of Christ, the spread of the early church and the lives of Christianity's missionaries gives us dependable sources for the basis of our faith. He accomplished all this while staying out of the spotlight. You notice that. Perhaps his greatest example is the challenge to greatness even when we are not the center of attention. We can briefly say about his character as a humble, faithful and useful companion of Paul, a well-educated and trained physician, a careful and exact historian and writer of both the Gospel of Luke and the Book of Acts. Excellence is shown by how we work when nobody is noticing us. This is the lesson we have to learn from Luke. Luke, uh, we, uh, the Gospel of Luke is very interesting to read and we have several incidents about uh, uh, Jesus Christ, how he traveled, how he showed compassion towards patients, towards lepers. So many things we see in uh, Luke and so many stories also. So please read the uh, book of Luke and uh, learn more about him. Let's pray. Lord, thank you, Lord, for teaching us about Luke, who was so compassionate, doctor, and uh, helpful to others. Please, Lord, in wherever place, whichever place we have kept, please help us to be useful to others. In Jesus' precious name I ask. Amen. God bless you.